Welcome back to DVR Club, the AV Club's TV recap show. I'm TV editor Eric Adams, and alongside me... Uh, Alex Dow, the film editor of the AV Club. And we're here to talk about the sixth season finale of Community, Emotional Consequences of Broadcast Television. A very community title <laughs> for what could potentially be the very last episode of community. And to that effect, I wanted to go right into top storylines to talk about the through line of the episode, uh, which is Jeff kind of coming to grips and becoming comfortable with the idea that he's going to stay behind. I feel like it's kind of been the through line of this entire season, actually. Jeff came in as, as this outsider and as somebody who was very determined to have a, a set amount of time at Greendale and is slowly coming to terms with the idea that he could be the last of these people to leave Greendale. He's like Hurley at the end of Lost almost, <laughs> which I feel like is a parallel that uh, community would not want us to make. <laughs> well, let's uh, take that then to a new segment for DVR Club, which is very appropriate for community, Meta on Meta. It's, an, it's a neat episode with a, a, a cool conceit where the characters sit around and they sort of talk about what the seventh season of their show would look like. Uh, Alex, how, how did you like that concept? Um, I wrestle with it a little bit. Uh, I, part of me wonders if, that, if, if that's taking the meta-ness of this show over the line. But at the same time, I feel like that's kind of where this had to go, especially this season. Harmon has been grappling with uh, the legacy of his show since really, I would say, the second season. And at this point, I, if this is the series finale, I don't, I'm not sure I see a more appropriate place for it to go than the characters literally discussing the show they've been a part of. And that was a motif throughout all of season six was Abed talking about the show. And now, in the end, it's a nice its a nice concession to... It's an acceptance. Yeah. I think that almost everybody sort of just gets on Abed's wavelength at the end of the show, which, which again feels uh, very appropriate for a show that could be winding down. Six years. Six seasons, right, Abed? Don't put a nickel in him. Stop mitigating everyone. So, Abed, what happens in season seven? I was kind of sad that Elroy you know, just walks off. Yeah, he's gone uh, at in the, the first beginning. five minutes, really. Yeah. You know? um, and I think that that was probably a decision that was made because we just need to streamline this thing as much as possible. Yeah, you know? absolutely. I will. I will say it's a very self-indulgent episode, but it's it's edited to a fine point. It is. Speaking of which, very nice to see uh, Yvette Nicole Brown coming yes, back. Absolutely. Uh, it was in... really nice to see her. I've missed her this whole season, and I'm not sure I was expecting to miss her as much as I have actually. You know, you don't realize how important she was to the dynamic of that group and what's gone with her being gone. And we get to see her in all these nice little pops that they do at the bar. That brings up our sound decision, which is the use of the theme song. This is the sort of thing I'm always a sucker for, which are these little audio cues. Uh, it puts me in mind of collaborative polygraphy from season five, where the, the lie detector is doing the lie, lie, lie. There's this nice established rhythm every time the, the theme song kicks in. Uh, in different variations, it speeds up. Uh, when when yeah. Britta is thinking of her season seven, it's sort of this like Tom, uh, Waits. Tom Waitsy <laughs> kind of thing. I can count the reasons I should stay. One by one, they all just fade away. It feels really generous to me too, because if this is the final episode, and I'm, I'm sorry we keep coming back to that, but it, it really does feel like a, a series finale to me. Um, but if this is the final episode, it's almost like Harmon and uh, the rest of the team is like, this could be the last time you're going to hear this song in the context of new episodes, so we're going to give it to you ten times. Let's move on into the next segment, Should They Have Kissed? One of the things that makes this feel so so final and, and so, so much of a conclusion is when Jeff and Annie share this kiss that has mm -hmm. they've been building toward for the whole season in some ways. Uh, Alex, do you think they should have kissed? I'm okay with it, I think. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm okay with it because it's uh, like their relationship's been for the entire run of the series. It's vaguely romantic, vaguely platonic. It suggests that there's a connection between these characters, but not that we are to expect anything more from that. You know? And in one of the season sevens that, that Jeff imagines when he's not strangling a million Abeds, <laughs> he and Annie have this sort of domestic bliss which doesn't satisfy either of them. Mm -mm. So that's that's a really or the audience. Yeah, or the audience. Yeah. Well, we've kind of devoted this entire episode to this topic, but I think it's time for Speculation Corner where we can kind of, you know, work out our feelings about how we would feel about another 
season of Community, or maybe even a movie. I this season in general, I think, has been very bumpy. Um, I think the the absence of key cast members has more than anything else has, I think, unbalanced the show in a lot of ways. Um, and with more cast members leaving, I can't see how it's possible that they can retain any of that energy. My nightmare is seeing something like the fantasy version that Jeff has in this, where it's Garrett and Todd and those characters sitting around the table, <laughs> and this is our new study group, you know? And I think, really, the show itself is ready to end. There's there's so many classic series finale moments throughout Jeff going back to an empty study room, mm -hmm. uh, the kiss that we mentioned, and also that great speech uh, that Abed gives. It's a really nice statement, I think, about what community has meant as, as a television series, how Dan Harmon views the TV medium. It, it feels like a great sort of closing argument. It's TV. It's comfort. It's a friend you've known so well and for so long. You just let it be with you. Well, community might not know if it's ending, but I know DVR Club is ending right now. Uh, thanks for watching. I've been Eric Adams. I'm Alex Dowd. Bye. Bye.